hey guys and welcome back to my channel so now that we are move. Cam. <laughs> Concentrate. now that we are now that we are in the final pretty much like the final month of the pregnancy and it's like getting really close to our baby's born we thought or i thought and have first cam into doing a very short like q a video and just talking a little bit about the pregnancy and the birth and everything and a little bit of the questions that you guys have been asking me on my instagram so i think we will maybe ask one another questions and we can also like comment on it as well um Ooh. so it should be fun and it's getting super close now, so it's getting a little bit exciting. It's like a month, basically. Yes. It's quite, it could be even closer. Okay, so let's start with... You ask a question. Do you think he is going to arrive on the due date? No, I don't. Okay, when do you because think he will Because he arrive? seems to be stubborn like me, and does his own thing like me. <laughs> so... I have a feeling that he's going to do his own thing. Okay, so earlier or later. I've always thought that he's going to come maybe like a week early or so. So that's what okay. I thought. Cool. What do you think? Yeah, I think so. I. Well, if he's like you, he would come on the due date because you are like so, like punctual. Punctual. Mm -hmm. Um, I because I mean I was sort of thinking like he will be slightly early, but then we spoke to someone who's had three kids and they were like the first one normally comes later so I, but ugh, mm. man everyone's different so everyone's different, yeah. who knows it's a shot in the dark we'll have to see when he arrives okay do i eat a lot now that i'm pregnant are you asking me yes yes you do <gasps> you're supposed to say no <laughs> oh, <flip. laughs> um i mean do i eat more i just i don't know if like you I eat, the same i don't know if you now. yeah that's true we pretty much eat the same but you just like, oh, I'm so hungry, I'm so hungry, I'm so starving. And then, but you've just eaten. Then, so then after I eat, I'm like, I feel so sick. Yeah, then I'm just like, <laughs> okay, give yourself 10 minutes to just like let your food settle. And I'm like, why are you so rude to me? And then, after, yeah, and then like, like 10 minutes so later, she's like, oh, I'm so full, I feel so sick. And I was like, well, yeah, maybe you should have just slowed down a little bit. Okay, do I take up most of the bed now? Yes, you do. You kind all of got this pillows. whole thing going on with like all your pillows and this like, that, that like pregnancy pillow that's like a U shape. It's like a and hook. It's sort of like, mm -hmm. it covers, it goes over the middle of the bed. I didn't realize it till the other day. And like I, I walked like out and I walked back into the bedroom. To sleep and on I saw, like a sleeping bag. <laughs> I saw a like cat. My knee like, hangs off the edge. like this and I just realized like, I'm literally using like 70% of the bed. Pretty much. That's a good. <laughs> I only realized a, the other no. day when I saw you. Know, you 70% you is, like a, is a good estimate. Bag. <laughs> literally like straight flat like arms and he's like on the edge like mm, like if i like roll if i don't keep my legs straight then my like knees will be off the bed <laughs> so i need okay. i need some more space nice just fyi um what else i've now officially even started wearing some of cam's undies <laughs> They're pretty comfy. Well, she said it's herself, not my fault. Comfy. Like we can't buy new stuff at the store because of yeah, the lockdown. Yeah, we can't actually. And my clothes are now getting to the point where they most of them are too tight. Because yeah. up until like I didn't get a very big tummy until like maybe 24, 25 weeks. So I didn't really need a lot of maternity clothes. No. So no. like I don't have that much maternity clothing actually. No, you don't. And then like we've been in this situation for four weeks and now suddenly I'm big and I don't have clothes. And yeah, in lockdown we can't go buy or anything. So, so now I'm using some of Cam's undies as shorts slash... Shorts <laughs> slash... Living clothes yeah. slash... Slash whatever. You probably won't get them back. Yeah, I probably won't. Are you going to cut the cord? I don't know. Should I? Is that a... I mean, I will. I think... Do you have a I desire think, to like... Do you have a deep desire to I, cut the cord you know what? of your son? <laughs> it's weird, but um, I think I will just do it because. <laughs> Why is it like it's weird? But <laughs> no, just because it's like it's such a a weird event. It's that, not something that you like have dreamed about. Doing. No, no, not at all. It's just <laughs> it's such a weird and uh, and once in a lifetime opportunity that I'll just do it just because. Once in a lifetime, I'm hoping it'll be two times in a lifetime. Yo, however many children in a lifetime, but. Okay. I'm just saying, would you like to be like Tom Cruise and eat the placenta? That is disgusting, <laughs> sick man. <laughs> That is absolutely <laughs> sickening. I can't even just... I remember like when I just saw pregnant, I showed Cam a photo of the placenta so and he was like, 
please oh. never show me that again. Like, it's so disgusting. Like, so sick. <laughs> and you just said, like, five minutes ago, you don't mind about blood. That's different. That looks like a weird... Tree. Like, alien <laughs> tree brain <of> <laughs> sack. Like, it's just sick. Anyway. The placenta is just something Cam cannot come to terms with. Well, there's a reason why it's hidden inside your body <laughs> and then thrown away afterwards. That is disgusting. <laughs> That's absolutely okay, but you are open to cutting the cord. Yes, I am. Do okay. they give you scissors? Like surgical scissors or do you use a scalpel? Knowing Cam, you probably want to use Leatherman. It could be fun. <laughs> but I'm saying, do they give you something? But they obviously have like medical you grades. You can't use your hands and your teeth. <laughs> I can't shave my legs. I can't see my you legs. You can't sit up. Like by yourself. Can't see my much. feet. <laughs> you have to. You, you like need me to like pull you up off the bed. Yeah, I feel like I've got no like core muscles. Le yeah, literally. Left. It's quite funny. <coughs> and acid reflux yes. is a bad thing. How has tell us about the side of the cons of pregnancy? Acid reflux being one of them. Sleeping is quite hectic because everyone gives you the most world's most annoying advice. I feel like every like clever tom wants to say to you oh sleep while you can it's like so irritating people say it to you like <laughs> um like you kind of want to say well i'm trying but i can't like i wake up yeah. so early I, I haven't had an alarm actually for most of my pregnancy i haven't needed one because i wake up so early our boy is quite active so then yeah. he's kicking and i can't go back to sleep i'm a little bit sensitive with that so I just like lie there and then... And the fact that you need to go to the my toilet time so much. <laughs> my time Cam opens his eyes, I've been awake for like two hours and I'm like irritated. Because I've yeah, like, had she's to like, wait for him. She'll literally like roll over and, and I like, like just stare go at him. on her phone. She'll be on, like, on Instagram and play a video like extremely <laughs> loud. Just to like in my ear basically to wake and me up. What or I like, good morning. Have you seen the song is it that wake up? It's a lovely day. <laughs> Wake up, wake up, it's a lovely <laughs> I'll sing day. That song like this so loud, like this in morning, my ear. I think it was yesterday or today that I sang that song today. Uh, it's all a blue, I don't know. And like Cam like, kind of opens his eyes like this, and I'm like, Wake up, it's an awesome day today. He's like, uh, He like just opens his eyes like yeah, this. She's like, Please go hectic. away. It's real. Because literally, by the time Cam wakes up, I've been awake for like two hours, and I'm like, I'm so angsty to get the day started, and we can't go anywhere. And I'm like, So I think that would be the kind of pregnancy, and I've really really struggled with heartburn which has developed into acid reflux so for me mm, that's that been quite extreme but i think it's because i'm quite short so i have a very short or small torso yeah so the baby is like you know taking, taking up, up everything and he's um been like this for quite a long with his time down. not across so he's got his feet like up here like in the stomach area like whatever <laughs> not not here <laughs> Yeah. Anyway, that's a here. con. What is your con? Yeah. No bed, no. Yeah, no bed. No food. <laughs> no food's been fine. Um, the food supplies are low. What else? To be honest, it's been actually great. Like yeah, like we been great. actually really enjoyed it. We were. I think for me, it's just the fact that he's healthy and and um, yeah, Rach rich. is healthy. Uh, other than the extreme acid reflux, yes. which sucks, but. For the most part, it's been amazing, and so we are really blessed in that sense, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, and thankful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, What's your question? How do you feel about like all the gory things about birth? I don't mind. Um, I think it's yeah. I'm not too faced by it. I've never really been the person that's worried about seeing blood or needles or you know anything like that so I don't I mean I haven't experienced it before like birth witness, well, witnessing a birth I hope not yeah it's true I haven't <laughs> but I think it'll be okay I mean it's going to be hectic but I think it'll be fine do you feel ready to transition to be a mom no mom? you know I don't I have like a breakdown about this like every second day <laughs> Okay, well, what, what, do, you what do you mean? Elaborate. Well, like every second day, I start to feel like, wow, I do not feel ready to become a parent. And we've been married for so long. And yet I'm so sentimental. And I'm like, oh my word, this is the end of just being Cam and me. And yes. we can't even do anything You're because we're stuck in, in the house. house. Word, I'm like a bucket list person. And I feel like yeah. I can't go to my favorite restaurants. and Get stuff that you want to buy. Just, and... Basically, every second day, I cry about this. Yes. <laughs> Um, the baby's kicking now. Hey, boy. Love you. Hey, dude. 
He's so he's, big and he's fat. He's really big and fat. <laughs> he's big and fat. Um, what is your? What are you most looking forward to about having our baby? I can't wait to hold him in my arms for the first time. I know. Like that's gonna be cool. He's been inside growing for so long, and I feel like I've gotten to know this little personality. And my yeah. top down looks random. That is random. <laughs> um, and yes, I am quite. Old. It's like a woolly, like fleece, <laughs> very furry like thing. Sheep. <laughs> um, I, like I mean, lately I've really been wondering, like, what does he look like? Like, does he have hair? Does he have like big ears or like? <laughs> is there any reason why you say that? <laughs> I like Cam's no. little big ears and yeah I don't know like I've just been wondering like what does he look like and I think that moment is going to be awesome yeah it's going to be really cool and I'm really wondering if he has hair or not well I had pitch black hair when I was born a lot I didn't of it have a lot well where did it go good question <laughs> okay let me think of something also subscribe to my channel we'll put the link in the description Cameron Williams. So Some subscribe. shameless self-promotion. Yeah, I don't put it in. That's weird. I'll okay, so a question people have asked a few times is like, are we nervous to become parents? <sighs> Good question. Are you? Yes, I I'm gonna, you can answer. Um, I think to a degree I am nervous in that it's a totally unknown thing and I don't know. Like I enjoy, you know, the idea of being a parent and I think kids are awesome. I don't the, mind them. The aspect that I don't have any experiences in, experience in one. is having a kid 24-7 for like the your rest of your life. That yeah. is different. When you're like, okay, cool, I'm playing with this kid. Okay, he's crying, you take it like back. raise them and like you know, help them develop and grow. Yes, and like, exactly. And they will be an exact carbon copy of what you <laughs> teach them, right? And what they, what they become is on you. Yeah. So that's quite hectic. Um, but uh, nonetheless, m more than that, I'm very excited and. Can't like, am to wear the baby carrier. Not really, but I'll wear it. I'm game. I'm a little bit nervous, like you said. It's yeah. like it's a full thing. It's a big thing. Yeah, I was gonna How do, do you feel about cleaning the nappies? Changing nappies. Like, I feel fine. I just I don't really know what it's gonna be like. I mean, it's, it's gonna be a disaster. <laughs> what it's gonna be like? I don't. Because I don't really do that often. I don't change people's nappies that often. So anyway, I think it's going to be quite a learning curve in terms of just the mess um, and the sort of sensory overload of yes, sights and that. sounds and smells. But um, I am up for the task. Yeah, it's laughing because the other day I said I feel like an elephant that fell over and can't get back up. <laughs> <laughs> so I feel like I just can't get up again. Um, I'm Remember really I said that? I was yeah. like from, a, from like Krug National Park and like just can't get up again. Can elephants fall over and get up? I don't know, I just imagine like How do elephants sleep? Toppling, I don't know. Do they sleep on their like bellies? <laughs> I, I think they go down. I think they sleep standing up. They just close their eyes. Some animals do, do that. Do sleep? <laughs> this is just like, you're actually acting like a child. I, no, 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 that kidding. is a legitimate question. <laughs> I think I heard, I remember from many years ago when I used to watch National Geographic when I was living with my parents and <laughs> I, there was this one advert that so said, random. ants never sleep. If ad, let us know in the comments if, elem, let us know in the comments below if elephants sleep standing up Google or sitting afterwards. down. Okay, that's all I have to say on that. Anyway, so I think that does about for the, for the Q&A. I think we're feeling excited and we're feeling yes, we feeling like Very it's excited. coming close. It's going to be awesome. And we're going to try for one or two more videos because I feel like once the baby's born, we're going to be stoked that we filmed a little bit because yes. it's going to be cool memories. Anyway, bye. Awesome, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any other questions, you can ask them on my Instagram. And um, yeah, the countdown is officially beginning. We are almost there. Months to go. And thank you for following the pregnancy journey with us because you guys have watched the birth announcement, the gender reveal, everything. Yes. So um, thank you. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.